Ben Stimson, and Aidan Minis, absconded to the Donetsk region of Ukraine to align themselves with Vladimir Putin's forces, boldly documenting their allegiance in videos posted online. The two men mark the first reported cases of British citizens engaging in combat for Putin. In the video, Stimson declared, Every man makes his choice. Many of us, foreign volunteers, have elected to stand with the Russian faction. Well, every man takes his choice. You lot have chose to go over to that side. But a lot of us chose to come over to this side, foreign volunteers, to the Russian side, because we believe what we're doing right. Colonel Richard Kemp, a former commander in the British Army, rebuked the duo telling the Mirror, these two are an absolute disgrace and are traitors who upon their return to the UK should be arrested and jailed. These two traitors clearly don't know who the enemy is. Stimson had initially gone to Ukraine in 2015, participating in conflict alongside Russian separatists in the Donbass region. He was arrested and charged with terror offences when he later returned home after helping Russia with the annexation of Crimea. After being released from prison in June of the previous year, People that knew him described how he became homeless and fell into substance abuse. Despite being detained upon his arrival at Manchester Airport, questioned by police under the Terrorism Act, and having his phone and laptop confiscated, he managed to proceed to Moscow via Istanbul. Aidan Minis, identified as Stimson's closest comrade in the Russian military, was a member of the National Front, and after beating up a homeless man, his lawyer told the court that Aidan believes Putin is still the greatest politician on earth. Should either individual attempt to return to the UK, they would face arrest under the Foreign Enlistment Act of 1870, which prohibits British nationals from joining armed forces opposing states in peaceful relations with Britain. Additionally, anti-terrorism statutes could be invoked upon their re-entry. Both Stimson and Minnis have flaunted their activities on social media, displaying weapons, flags, and even dead bodies in their posts. Yes, yes, I'm back in Russia and I'm back in uniform. Despite the C uh, Manchester CTU, we've got some British taxpayers' uh, returns. For GB News, I'm Joe Wilmot.